now we will see the use of some more controls that is image and timer before starting with these controls just have a look on how to save the project move to save button we will save these forms on a particular drive inside a specific folder so to create a new folder just use create new folder suppose vb chapters fine under this folder see here first the forms will be saved and at last you will have to enter your project name so form 2 suppose security screen so just type the form name save it form 1 we have seen school mark sheet save it now it is asking for a project name so from next time onwards you just please remember the project name instead of opening each and every form we have to open the project as soon as the project is open then all the forms will be dis displayed under that project so project suppose we are giving chapter first working with controls save just click on no fine to close this project move to file remove see the project has been closed to open the project again file open project see here just select the drive select the folder in which you have saved your project vb chapters see a project name is in front of you just click and press open fine see here to move between forms double click on form in this way you can save your project and open the project now we will add a new form here right click on project explorer move to add click on form now have a look to a new control that is image just double click to insert the pictures open image control properties move to picture property have a suitable picture from here suppose from graphics folder move to icons under icons just we will move to traffic see related to traffic all the pictures are displayed in front of you just have one of the picture click press open a picture has been added to your form on a image control to increase the size of an image just stretch it but you will find size is not increased for this move to stretch property and make it true see you will find the difference the next property is left property to move the image on different locations on a form from left side from here just move to left property type the number suppose 5000 press enter see the image is moving from left side if you decrease it means minus same way you can move the image from top side also just increase the number see if you decrease it means it will go upside and 
the width and height property you can change the width of this suppose 5000 width and you require a height 5000 so instead of mouse you can use the width and height property so we have covered the properties related to image suppose more images you require take the image control see here just move to picture property once again have a picture fine same way for third image move to folder box select picture open so we have three pictures on our form with three different images control to set the prop width and height for all the three images select all of the three images change the stretch property to true and width 2000 and height to 2000 fine you will find all the images have the same size now so here we complete the image control properties it is used to insert different types of pictures having an extension BMP JPG GIF ICO etc now have a look to next control that is timer timer is used to execute the code as per specified time means previously we have written a code on a command button if you click the mouse then only the code fires but if there is a requirement to run the code on a specified time then you have to use a timer control to set the time just move to interval property and type the seconds here if you type 100 100 means millisecond so 100 millisecond equals to 1 second so we will just set the time to 2000 means 20 seconds time we have to use to activate these images fine we will now create a simple graphic animation program with the help of timer see here there are three images in front of you by name image 1 image 2 and image 3 by default all the three images are visible true see here for each and every control if you see one of the property that is visible set to true when you place the control from a toolbox to a form each and every control visible property is set to true just to hide it we have to change it to false so at the time of runtime this image will not be displayed in front of you so with the help of this visible property we can create a traffic signal program and to activate and deactivate it on a particular time we are having a timer control fine we will write a code on timer now just assume one of the control is true so if image one dot visible equals to true then so image 1 is already true so we will make image 1 then and there visible to false fine image 2 dot visible equals to true and image 3 dot visible equals to false so in first slot we are keeping the image 2 visible true so we are having three images just continue with the second I'll say if image 2 dot visible equals to true we will just copy this code 
कंट्रोल सी कंट्रोल वी इन दिस लॉट वी विल कीप इमेज थ्री टू ट्रू लास्ट वी आर रिमेनिंग नाउ टिल नाउ इमेज वन इज नॉट सेट टू ट्रू सो एट एस पार्ट वी विल चेंज इट टू ट्रू द क्लोजिंग ऑफ इफ विल बी एंड हियर बाय एंड इफ hope you understood this code to have a preview we will just set the form 3 to start up object move to project menu project 1 properties and click form 3 press okay we will now run the form start see here as we have written the code on a timer it will automatically make visible true and false after 20 seconds see once a yellow highlight color is there red and green but at three different places you are getting this highlighted visible true and false so for this just have a simple logic select all the three images go to left property and set the property 5000 means all the three images should be placed on 5000 pixel from left side now we will run the program once again see here with the help of timer and images we have created a simple animated program graphics program can be created in vb in different ways with the help of timer we can change the colors of controls or forms we can just move the controls from one place to another place or activate or deactivate the controls with the help of visible property So in this video we have covered the concept of saving and opening a project and apart from label text box and command button we have covered the use of image and timer